All right, once again, not my normal camera, but we were rushed. <laughs> I had literally five minutes ago sent a text to uh, the Tesla advisor where we're headed now. I was like, because we have a wedding to go to tomorrow, not our own, we've been married for a while. I said, right. and literally I said, uh, is there a possibility of a Saturday pickup? And if so, can it be early? Because I've been, and today, by the way, what is today? The 6th of March? Yes. All right, 6th of March, Friday. So I said, is it a possibility that we be there on Saturday? And if so, early. And I literally had just pressed send and then my phone rang. And it was them. And she goes, hey, I got some good news. I'm like, and she goes, uh, it's ready for pickup. It's been inspected, blah, blah, blah. I was like, <gasps> I was like, so uh, what you're telling me? I said, can I, and it's a two hour drive for us. So I went, when can I come? I said, can I come tonight? You guys are open till eight. She said, yeah. I said, be then about two hours. And she gets off around the time we're gonna get there. But we're in the car, we're headed down there. So I might have a little B-roll. You'll see it in a couple seconds. But we're on the way. We have to drive the I-3 down, and then the I-3 and it back. So, but the I-3, we can make it down there. Probably have to fill up with gas once, and then we can make it there. And we don't have to worry too much. We got, we'll have plenty to make it there and back. But, but we'll have to stop at least once, possibly at least in this car. But that's that. We're on our way to go get it. Better turn right. Well, crap. Where should I park? Some white Model 3s, one of them is set to go. With the black wheels and all. Hey, that could be our car. I think that's it. Without looking at the numbers, I think that's it. Ready? So that's it. now so I'm gonna look at it since it's mine well as soon as I hand him a $25,000 check <gasps> it's so pretty I can't wait to sit in it might as well start looking at it I'm gonna turn you off for a bit so that I can do an inspection right. so we were kind of just going over it and there's a couple spots still gonna drive it home don't get me wrong but there's a there we go there's a couple spots on it all right, I'm backwards, like up underneath here on the plastic. There's a, uh, it just bows down on both sides, so it's kind of weird. It's very weird that it's on both sides. I looked at one of the other Model 3 sitting right here and it doesn't have it. So I don't think it comes standard with a little bowy thing on the plastic on the bottom. So we're just gonna let them know that too. There's another little scuff on the passenger rear side. They tried to get their detail person out here to uh, like see if it was like goo to be able to wipe it off. If they couldn't wipe it off so we're just getting all the stuff documented so they know it's not our fault that we drove away with it like this that they can fix it on uh under warranty we'll take it like to bloomington or something like that but uh we gotta get the garage door opener still <laughs> didn't get to wear my white shirt we were in such a hurry to get out the door didn't get to dress for my occasion i was gonna wear my white shirts and black pants to go in the new black and white car didn't get to do it all right, I know it's dark, but driving it, first drive, it's already weird because I don't have an instrument cluster in front of me to look at. But boy, them headlights are nice. In first drive, I had to stop the camera just to do the camera. I got some settings I gotta do. I gotta do with the brake regen. I'll probably do that on the trip. But we have 88%, so this is gonna be interesting. Here's my baby, here's my i3. She want me to drive it. I kind of want to drive it the first time just to make sure there ain't nothing crazy going on. Don't even have my navigation going on. I'm going to stop this camera so I can get some of my settings set real quick.